What is up everybody and welcome back to my little corner of YouTube here where it is time to level me up. And as you can see there, I just completed Act 5.3. So, let's open up these rewards. Let's get a 5 star awakening gem. And uh, yeah, get some rank up gems. Be pretty fantastic. So we are going to start off with the 5 star awakening gem crystal. Um, so this is going to be a class specific awakening gem. Out of this I think... I think I would love a mutant. I think I would love a mystic because I don't have a single duped mystic yet. And I think I'd be okay with a tech or any of the others. So I am handing the phone over to my boy Oz, and he is going to spin this crystal out while I go do some work. So yeah, here it is. Or don't talk. That's cool too. He's not going to talk. He's not going to say anything. He's just going to chill and let it spin. I feel like he has a fear of, uh, of saying anything. But whatever, it's all good. So I'm, I'm going over my, my characters in my head here. And I'm pretty sure absolutely any one of these will be awesome. I would love science because then I could do void or awaken void. Skill? Skill isn't so bad. There's a couple of skill people that I can definitely use this for. Let's actually go take a quick look at them first. And then we'll come back and we'll pop those rank up crystals. All right, so here we go. So number of people that are pretty solid in here, Crossbones, Gwenpool, of course, Hawkeye. I like Hawkeye, so his um, sig ability apparently is not really good until it is like really high. So Gwenpool is probably going to be the number one choice here. Um, not really a huge fan of the Black Panthers or Agent Venom. Uh, they're kind of useful, like, for defense-wise. But not really looking forward to uh, rank anybody up specifically for defense. Um, I think Gwenpool is pretty good for Act 5.42. Uh, or 5.4 as well, I should say. But... Uh, yeah, I'm going to think about that one just a little bit longer here before I actually go and use it. So let's get this one going. We're just going to pop these crystals. All right, so a tech, that will be pretty useful because I have a Star-Lord that I think I can rank up now. So I'll finally get my, my Star-Lord up to rank five. Fantastic. One more crystal here that we're going to rank up with our rewards, which is going to be the five star rank up crystal. And this will either be one to two or two to three. It is a rank two to rank three. You know what I find funny about this crystal is that in the picture above, the two is on the right, the three is on the left. The actual rank up, the two is on the left, the three is on the right. Just a little thing. Little thing. So we got a cosmic. And pretty sure that's all the crystal rewards we got so far. Gonna be hitting up 5.4, so we'll be able to get some more out of that. Another awakening gem for sure, as well as some five stars. Alright, so with this one. Let's take a look at these rank up gems. Now, I was thinking it would actually pop up who you could use it on, but let's see here. Okay, so Angela is the number one choice right there, and I can use it on her. Now, a lot of people think that uh, the rank up gem means that you don't have to spend any gold, it's just like a free rank up. It's kind of free. You don't have to use any of your cats for it, so no basic, no class cats, no alpha cats. You get to save those for somebody else. But you still need the gold. You still have to use up that gold. 
But uh, yeah, ranking Angela up to rank three, be able to max her out at level 45, I think that would be pretty fantastic. She hits like a truck. Um, so that's kind of cool. The other five stars that I have, so Drax is already ranked three. Venom Pool, I don't think I would want to rank him up. And Captain Marvel, Unduped, thinking I don't want to rank them up. So this one's pretty clear cut and dry. It's going to be Angela. She will get ranked and leveled up here pretty soon. Or save it until I get like Corvus or somebody else that I really like to play. Uh, let's go to the other one. This is gonna be four star Tex. And yeah, so Star-Lord I think is gonna be the number one choice there. Also got Doc Ock. Looks like I have to give him a couple of levels. I might actually, I don't know, let's take a look here at Star-Lord. So yeah, he is a rank three right now. So I'd have to put some materials into him first, get him up to rank four, but then I could take him all the way up to rank five without an issue. So I will probably do that. I'll spend the three T4 basic cats. And uh, yeah, I think that is where I'm gonna end it. Thanks so much for stopping by. Truly do appreciate it. And I will see you guys next time.